Hey everybody, it's Mike. Got my convoy stretched out here. First up, this is a Maisto. This is a custom homemade deal here. I took, uh, I got this old red truck from uh, Mike Espo. Got two of them. Well, I took uh, one of them and I cut the cab off and I took the tail end of it. Welded it onto the tail end of this other one. Put it together there. And then I had this old tank. I've been hanging. I have, I've had this old tank here for a long time. Anyhow, put the tank on it. Fixed it on up there. Yeah, I did. So it's just an old custom. Custom Maisto. And what the, the, the cab that was left over. I welded it onto this trailer that Alpha Diecast sent me and uh, moved the axles forward on the trailer. And it ain't a trailer no more. Now it's just a truck, a homemade custom truck. All right. Next, I got this truck from Mike Espo. I robbed the wheels off of it. And. Put this set of wheels on it because I had some more wheels just like it. And I put them on this trailer. I've had this trailer for a long time, but no truck. Had some big old ugly wheels on it. I've just been hanging on to it. Figured one of these days I'd get a truck to go with it, fix her up. So now I finally got her fixed up. I repaired the exhaust pipes on this one. They were broke off, so I made some tips. Put on there. Yeah. And next up, this truck here. That was the one I homemade. Yeah. I homemade this truck. And uh, I'm going to see if I can get this here to brighten up a little bit. I don't know if it's going to stay. But uh, anyhow, I'm going to leave it right there and maybe to stay. It looked like it did. Anyway, I made this truck, tr uh, made it a six-wheeler out of a four-wheeler. And so the wheels that was left uh, on it, plus another truck like this, I robbed them wheels. And I put on this trailer. I got this trailer from Alpha. Made this set up. Yeah. All right, next up. I got this Matchbox truck from... Uh, Mike S. Poe got the trailer from Alpha Diecast. Didn't have to do nothing except put them together because they already had the matching set of wheels. Looked good. I think it's a pretty good combination of black cab with a yellow truck with red letters, I guess. I don't know. But anyway, to me, it does. Next up, got this here truck from Mike S. Poe. Got the trailer from Alpha. Didn't have to do nothing to it. Wheels already matched. So it's good to go. All right, moving on. That uh truck that I fixed the broken exhaust pipes on, the, you know, I robbed the tires off of it. Well, they was the same tires as this truck. So I used the rear tires and put on this trailer and matched this truck and trailer up. I got this cab from Mike Espo, the trailer from Alpha. All right, moving on. I got this truck from Mike Espo. The trailer from Alpha, and all I had to do, the truck had the, the wheels on it. All I did, I found something in my junkyard that had the same kind of wheels on it. I robbed them off, put on the trailer to match. There we go. All right, next up, I didn't have no matching wheels to match it with this, so I had to take the wheels off of this truck. I got this truck from Mike Espo. I robbed the wheels off of something else, and then also something else, and I put all the wheels on this. Matched up this. Trailer from Alpha. 
All right. <coughs> Excuse me. Moving on back down here. Next up, we got this truck from Seoul in England. So I didn't have no matching wheels to match up to the trailer. So I took all the wheels off the truck. The wheels off the trailer, got the trailer from Alpha, and I found some matchbox stuff that had several different matchbox vehicles, three of them actually, and I rubbed the wheels off of them and put them on this truck to match, so I think it looks pretty good. Next up, I got this truck from Seoul, trailer from Alpha. I think they matched up pretty good. I rubbed the wheels off of some matchbox stuff. Put on here so they all be the same. All right, next up, I got this truck from Seoul. I didn't have to do nothing to the wheels on it. And being I robbed the wheels off of one of those two, I had wheels to put on the trailer. So we matched that truck, matched that trailer up with that truck. That's trailers from Alpha. All right, next up, this truck. It's from Alpha. It's a hot, it was a Hot Wheel. It had old little bitty tires on the front, and it was real low in the front. So I took all the wheels off, and I found some Matchbox wheels to put on here. Raised the front end up where it would look like a truck's supposed to look. And I already had this trailer. I put some wheels on it to match. Put it together. All right, next up, same with this. I got this truck from Alpha, the trailer also. The Hot Wheel with little bitty tires on the front, and it was real low in the front. So I took all the wheels off, done whatever necessary, found some wheels from Matchbox, put on it and the trailer to match. Yes, sir. All right, next up, I got this truck. And as you remember, uh, I mentioned a while ago, I robbed the wheels off of uh, the half a cab that was left over. Well, I also robbed the wheels off it, off this one rather, to put on that triple axle trailer. So I had three axles. So I went in my junk pile, found this set of wheels and another set of wheels, put them on here, and we come up with that. All right, next up, this is a truck that I started out with putting a dual, I mean, uh, putting six wheels on. So, the leftover of the, what is, what, the leftover part of this truck, or the truck that I robbed this uh, back end off of, I uh, made a wrecker out of it, but I didn't bring it out here. Y'all have seen it before, most of you have. But anyway, I made a full load of logs on this one because I bought a second, you know, another truck and. Uh, Took all the logs off of it. There's 15 logs here. The truck came with five, so the second truck came with five, five, and then the third truck come from with five. So I put all 15 together, so that left uh, a tr an empty truck because the other truck got this, got got cut in us, uh, cut up, and made into something else. But anyway, this is the truck that was empty. I went and found some wood and put on it. Got, got her loaded up now by George. Didn't do no wheel changing on it. Left it a single axle on it. See, that, that, that right there is what that used to look like until I added the rear to it. I ain't never painted that JB weld black yet. One of these days I will. But anyway... This here is a majorette. The front end was broken on it. So I had to, uh, I finally got around to fixing it. I've had this thing for a long time too. So anyhow, I put some pieces in the front end and built it back up to where she'd set up right. And I took all the wheels off of it because they, they were in rough condition. And I put this set of wheels on it. And I got this trailer. I hate to say it, but this is one of the trailers I got from Alpha, the one that said Snapple on the side of it. I used that box for parts of plastic pieces I needed. 
and I robbed the doors off of it and put on on the green one because it was missing the door and the green one was a lot better trailer anyway. So I saved this frame. I got I don't I, I got I got three of these black things left over from that trailer that uh, I made into a wrecker. So I may mount, I may take those three things and put on here and make this another log truck. But I also have a thing I can make a dump bed out of it too, make this a dump truck trailer or something. Anywho, this truck here I got from Mike Espo. It had only, it was only originally four wheels. This was a rollback truck. And part of the rollback back was missing or something there. I don't know. Anyway, it says Eddie's towing on the side of the door. So anyway, I took one of those other vehicles I scrapped out. And I took uh, the axle holding piece. And I JB welded it onto here. And then I slipped a set of axles in it, put it in there, you know. And uh, I had to break these, I had to break these here uh, tanks off because they were back here in the way. So I broke them off, got the wheels mounted, and then later on I welded the wheel, I welded these tanks back on a little bit to the little forward. Now, as you can see, it looks pretty good. I get, I guess. Anyway, there's another trailer. So you know, I don't, I don't know what I'm gonna do with that yet. I put matching set of wheels on it and everything. So anyhow, that's uh, that's my uh, convoys. I still got uh, the Skyjacker truck in the house and the tank truck from the latest Matchbox. Plus, I have five other trucks that are stashed. And then the two more that are still in the package. Actually, three more that are still in the package. It's from way back here, 20 years ago. I mean, there have been out to the package maybe well they might have been out of the package but only just for a brief brief moment so anyway uh i got a ton of uh i say a ton i got a bunch more uh wheel swaps that i've done all the one uh there's half of the stuff that i robbed these wheels off of i put wheels back on but the other half they're not, uh, they wasn't worthy to me to, uh, put the wheels back on them. So some of them, some of them just going to be scrap pile guarantee you, but, uh, I'm going to, do, I'm going to have to do another video on, on the rest of it. I got, uh, the wheel swaps and, uh, I'll show what, I robbed the wheels off of and what I put back on it. And also, uh, I'll show y'all the scrap pile of the uh, the ones that won't get back the, the ones that won't get wheels back on them. Put it that way. So anyhow, until then, I'm gonna get on out of here. Y'all check out Mike Espo on YouTube and also Alpha Diecast, and also check out each other on the comment section. Subscribe to my friends out there. You'd be glad you did. Until next time, this is Mike. And I'm going to get on out of here. No doubt. Uh, I'm gone.